Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode 65. Sorry, I had to double check the rundown sheet. And we're continuing our playthrough of Chrono Trigger. We finished off Queen Zeal. We finished off Lavos's Outer Shell. And Frog is asking us. He is truly slain. I detect even more powerful life force within Lavos's shell. These plates are but its armor. What we need is what we need destroyed lies within. Da, 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 da. Oh, beautiful. We've got a gate and a save point. So first things first, we're going to hit the save point. This is one dreadful place, even more ghastly than Magus's keep. According to my sensors, we are close to the core. So let's do this first. Let's go to the inventory. Actually, no, we're we're gonna we're gonna end up heading back to the end of time. So let's go save. Save that beautiful progress. And if we were playing the regular game, or if I hadn't have had a completely absent-minded moment, we would head up that way and continue the fight through all the various uh, bits of Lavos and, and knock off each, each form as we go. But since I am an absent-minded individual, we're going to head through the gate, and that should take us to the end of time. Good thing I saved before I walk through the portal, huh? That way, if I was wrong, <laughs> we've got a... Yeah, there we go. Come on, guys. There we go. Good. So, now we can go here. Show everybody's hit points and magic points. The Black Omen is gone, and that woman's tortured soul is finally at rest. She has regained her humanity at last. Now is the time for you to enter the gate contained within that bucket. You fight not only for yourselves, but for all that lives and breathes in this world. This is a battle between Lavos and the very planet itself. Dun dun dun! Or... I could, um... Alright, let's get Lavos back in the... Or Mag... <laughs> Lavos. Magus back in the party. Because he got the big nasty magic. And let's hit up the epoch. And we're going to take off and we're going to head back to prehistory. Because if you remember, there was a part that um, opened up. The Nintendo DS version and one of the other re-releases had three special areas that was added to the game. And when Steam did its port of Chrono Trigger, it carried over the Lost Sanctum, uh, which was not where I'm looking. And I'd completely forgotten about it. I, I was going through, there we go. I was going through the, uh, the YouTube comments and uh, I wish I could pronounce the name. Vegister? Ve Vegister? I, I am so sorry for butchering your name. Believe me, I, I I understand it on both sides of it, especially when Good Times with Scar keeps calling me Aaron um, <laughs> instead of Anon. I get it. I totally understand, and I deeply, deeply apologize for that. What we're going to do is we're going to come through here, and we're going to start in on the Lost Sanctum side quest. This is a bit of bonus content that is in the Steam and Nintendo DS versions. Uh, and what's the other one? And the mobile version, the, the one that's available for your phone. So if you're playing Chrono Trigger on your phone, DS, or Steam, you get this. And completing all, all the side quests here will get you a vendor who sells Mega Elixirs and some of the best armor in the game. Which is probably why I shouldn't have dumped quite as much. But again, I totally forgot about this part. So, let's go through. First thing we got to do is we got to head back to prehistory and we got to go clear out the sanctum. Uh doo -doo 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 -doo. yeah. Cave in the northern forest. Okay. Let's do this. Hmm. 
I've not seen this place before. Is this a world apart from our own? Perhaps a dif different dimension altogether. There may be some value in the knowing. Well, since we've come all this way, shall we have a look around? Good. There's a save point in there, too. Can I not walk in the open door? I cannot walk in the open door. Alright, good to know there's a save point in here. Uh, feel a bit lost because I didn't see this before. Oh, anybody here? Apparently not. But it looks to be a village of sorts, does it not? Mayhap a search will turn up some people. What do you think I've been doing, man? Or or is that what I gotta do? Is I just gotta... Yeah, alright, fine. Yeah, some of this does look familiar, though. Oh. I want the box. It's over there. Or is there another ladder? Take me to the box. Up this way. Hmm. Still not triggering anything either. Alright, uh... Back up here then. Since it doesn't seem to want to let me through any doors or anything. Or maybe I can't get to the box until uh, until I do some other part of the quest, and then maybe the magic shrubbery will disappear and move. Hello? Hello, is anybody there? Oh, hi guys. Monsters everywhere, yet they seem to be no humans. Are they all dead? Hmm. Either way, we best clear out all these monsters. Alright, let's do it. Leroy. <laughs> Sorry. Let's just hit them all with all the top, top stuff. Oh, that was uh easier than I was expecting. Okay, <laughs> seven hundred XP. Ooh, let the good times roll. No secret or anything. Okay. It's in the box. A high potion. High potion. Okay. And more critters. Natch. Alright, let's just hit you on with that. Queue up the rest just in case. Okay. Not too bad. This does appear to be a lower level than I was expecting. I'm not complaining, though. I guess because it's at the level cap for everything you'd do there. Alright, I was trying to see if there was anything behind the shrub, but... Oh, there was a guy behind the shrub. Eh... All right, we got this. I probably could have let Frog do his uh, water too, and that probably would have taken them all out too. Oh well, it's good for the content. Keeps everything moving. Yay! Some XP worth writing home about, and a level up. Always nice. Hello? Is he really going to be the only one? Oh, no. Okay, that's different. Go ahead, get your water too on. Oh! Wow, that wasn't enough? Come on, man. 
get on the offense. Okay. Note to self. Chrono and Magus. Wipe him out with the top level magic. Let Captain McUseless over there just uh, heal us if anything bad happens. Secret path under here? No? Well, it wouldn't be the first time I missed a secret path because I can't, you know, use the direction pad properly. Alright. No, who's gonna come out of the woodwork now? Oh, oh, hi guys. Hello! Have you heard the good news about the dark matter? This stuff! The flying triangle of spacicle. Or something. Okay. That's gone and done. Another thousand XP. Ooh, Magus level. Yeah, I'm actually kind of surprised he hasn't leveled up more than he has already. Hmm. I believe those were the last of them. What now? Do we return? Yes, mayhap we overlook something. I don't know. Like the dot on the, the dotted plant sitting here? What's this? Hmm, a young seedling. Hmm. Ooh, there we are. Oh, an elixir. Okay. And what about you? You got an Athenian water? Although, since we're going to visit this again in 600 AD, we probably ought to, uh,. Not loot it just yet. He says as he uh, continues looting everything in sight. Alright, let's bravely run away. Is that a shortcut? I wish that was a shortcut. Okay. Kind of miss the games where you could interact with the uh, shrubberies there. Like, where, where's your Zelda sword so you can just kind of cut down the shrub and walk through? Gotta be a way over there. There's a way around everywhere else. Or maybe that's it in the bottom left corner there. Come on, I want that last box. It's probably gonna be some rinky little potion or something like that. But, uh, it's a box. And it's got stuff. And I like stuff. There we go. <laughs> okay, 20,000 gold. That was well worth the, uh, that was well worth it. Okay. Okay, 20k is always nice. Now we can leave. Yeah, I'm probably going to end up having to sell a bunch of the stuff that, uh, anything in there now? Nope. Anything in there now? Nope. How about now? Nope. Nope. What about up here? Hello? I mean, this sounds like the village music from, uh... Prehistory. Oh, something's happening. Not to be found here, it seems. Shall we return, then? Who's making all that hullabaloo outside? Go on, get yourselves eaten by monsters. Serve you right, it will. Oh, there is someone here, after all. You are a reptite, are you not? I probably should have had Ayla for this. Talking apes, and they stand upon two feet? What madness is this? You'd call me an ape? You'd best learn your place, and quickly... Well, never mind that. Did you not spy any big, strong beasties about? We've slain the monsters that lurked in this place. I hope you'll not be missing them. You... you what? Oh, 
Oh, you wonderful, beautiful apes. Hmm? We're free at last, prisoners in our own homes no more. After all these long years of suffering. Come out, everyone. The monsters are gone for good. This isn't some cruel joke, is it? Is it truly safe? We can come outside? You have our most heartfelt thanks. Who would have dreamt that eight men would come to save us? Our days of cowering in cramped caves are finally at an end. And my days of taking you seri not seriously have come to a middle. You've done us a great kindness. It's not much, but we'd like to offer you this and thanks. After all you've done, it's the least we can give you. Ooh, we got a dragon's tear. What's a dragon's tear? I, uh, well, I mean, provided you all, you've the time and all, but being as strong as you are, I don't suppose you'd be willing to lend an ear when we've needed some help, would you? We wouldn't ask you to work for free, of course. We're prepared to compensate you for your efforts. And I think it would be worth your while. What do you say? Yes. Excellent. Come and speak to us now and again, then. We'll tell you if we've ever have need of anything. Yet more meaningless endeavors? Hey, he's there. Alright, um... Nah, because we can always take the gate back and heal up and... Uh, okay, Magnus is hurt far enough. Let's go ahead and inventory. Let's use that shelter. Do I actually need that strength? Oh yeah, Magnus does. There we go. Alright, what is that dragon's tear? Uh, nope. Dark pants, uh, nope. What was that? Oh, yeah. Never mind. Nope. Dragon's Tear. Oh, boost the critical hit rate. I, I was... I was hoping for more. Am I wrong for that? Alrighty then. Let's go ahead and uh, get a save in here real quick. Let's go ahead and uh, switch on over to the credits and say thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch or Mixer, hang tight. There's still three more episodes to come. If you want if you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's links in the description below. And if you haven't already, follow on Twitch. Get notified when I go live. Uh, at the time of recording, I am also simulcasting to Mixer. You're free to follow along there. However, by the end of March, I will no longer be actively using Mixer. So follow in case in case I need to use it as a backup, and, you know, just in case something happens with my Twitch account or whatever. But uh, no matter what, go over to the YouTube channel and subscribe there. It helps the channel out and you'll get notified when new episodes and other content get posted. So live, folks, give me a minute to prep the next episode. And YouTube, folks, I'll see you tomorrow.